What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Mark Dark, and I'm back with another video. If you're new, if you love power, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, like the video, and leave your theories, comments, everything down below. Now, today, we're going to be talking about Power Book 2 Ghosts, Tasha's fate. Is Tasha gone? Is she leaving the show, right? Now, I've been getting this message all week. Of course, Notori, she's the one that put it up on her Instagram about her thoughts on the latest of Power Book 2 Ghosts, her journey, Courtney Kip and everything like that. So we're going to talk about this. I'm going to read it off because everybody is wondering, is Tasha done with the show? Will she be in season two? Hmm. That's something that we need to talk about. So you guys need your theories, predictions, everything down below. And let me read this. Now it reads in this Instagram post, your girl Notori, she wrote this. The masterminds, Courtney Kemp and 50 Cent. I can't say enough how grateful I am that I have been blessed with this amazing journey full of power and ghosts. Courtney, thank you for stretching me as an actress and giving me the baddest chick on TV to play. When I wasn't sure if I could do something, you made me see that I could keep effing her till I tell you to stop. Seeing a black woman be a showrunner, creator, writer with such passion, love, class, fearlessness has inspired me immersely and 50 we almost had a fight last year but it's all love though seriously thanks for fighting for this show that no one heard of at first since day one and for seeing how important tasha is to the streets i learned a great deal from you both and i'm honored that tasha was able to be such an important piece of the culture team tasha for life power never ends um that is what she put out, man. And of course, a lot of fans, they are talking about this. Notori put this out. And they believe that Tasha may not be in Power Book 2 Ghosts like that. Um, some say that this is a farewell um, and that Tasha probably is gone. What do you guys think? Now, I'm going to tell you exactly how I feel about this and what I think. So down below, let me know. Let the fans know exactly how you see it playing out in what she really meant by putting this out there. Now, of course, we did see something similar like that with your boy Omari, but that was actually a farewell. We knew he wasn't coming back based on that, um, of course, message that he put out when Ghost was shot. So that's how everybody pretty much knew, like, okay, this is probably it for him. Now, of course, he could pop back up, but we have to wait and see down the line. Now, with Tasha, of course, she's still alive in the show. And... By writing this out, Notori writing this out, yeah, you can take it as, look, look, I am going to be out or whatever. But she never really said, look, I am stepping away for a little bit and that's it. Thank you. I will see you when I see you. She didn't say anything like that. Now, Tasha's whole storyline, of course, is something to talk about. As I told you guys, everybody that I know wanted to see a little bit of more of Tasha's storyline when she was locked up. Um, I was expecting to see the life behind bars with Tasha. I thought it was going to be a little bit more ruthless. Um, that lifestyle behind bars, she's going to get into some, some fights. We didn't really see that, of course, because we know the main focus was, of course, on the new casting of Power Book 2 Ghosts. They wanted to give this new generation more time, and that's exactly what they did. Tasha did, did not get a whole lot of screen time, and she didn't really get... A lot until the very end right until we saw her get out of prison and now what's going to happen next with her character we know tasha is leaving she's going into witness protection arizona maybe somewhere else but she is leaving for sure now how will she be wrote back into the storyline do you honestly believe they're gonna write tasha out now i'm telling you right now i think tasha she may be gone for a little bit but to write her completely out the story is just not going to happen you have to fulfill her story her story has to be complete that's how i take it she may not be in power book 2 go season 2 like that but as far as her story that needs to be told it needs to be some type of conclusion um for her story and as of right now courtney kemp or anybody did not come out and say that tasha won't be in the next season as far as i know she will be in this next season um but based on what she put out in this Instagram post, it does make it seem like she's stepping away for a little bit, taking a break, which if that's what she has to do, so be it. We all wish 
your girl Notori nothing but the best. But at the same time, we do want to see the conclusion of her storyline in this show. Um, and I think that's something that needs to be talked about because she still has Yasmin. And based on what Cordy Kemp said, Yasmin would definitely come into play. She's getting bigger. All the stuff that's happened to her, losing a sister, losing a father, and her mom being locked up, all the stuff that she saw, is definitely going to have a huge impact on her. And as I always tell you guys, remember, the smaller characters, they will come and take over at the end of the day. And it's the characters that we don't look out for is the ones that we have to watch for. Eventually down the line, if Courtney Kemp is true to her word as far as Yasmin and some of these other characters, I say nine times out of ten, we're going to see that happen down the line. Um, but I just want to know how Tasha is going to raise her. What will Tasha actually do? Because if Tasha is saying, like, look, we have to go. Um, this lifestyle is too risky. I don't want you to get hurt, Tariq. It's kind of weird because Tasha at first was all down for teaching Tariq the game. But that was before, of course, Tommy Egan was coming for her life. Um, that was before she was in fear for her life and her family's life altogether. Now, Tasha's on the run. But we know it's only so much running you can do. Eventually, you're going to have to stop and go somewhere. Will Tommy Egan really be on the hunt trying to just find Tasha 24-7? Absolutely not. Tommy Egan has an organization to run. He has different things he needs to do. Tasha, on the other hand, she has the kids to raise. And that's exactly what she's going to do. But how will she gain money, do the things that she needs to do to take care of her family? Because we know she doesn't get any money back from ghosts. Tariq's not giving her anything until, of course, he graduates and gets all the in-state from James St. Patrick. Until that happens, you're not going to see Tasha doing that. Um, I can really see Tasha getting back into the game. I know Tasha's talking about how legit she wants to be and she's done with the lifestyle. But how many times did Ghost say that and he kept, kept getting pulled back in? Tasha, on the other hand, doesn't have any type of money. You know what I'm saying? She doesn't have nothing. So if you don't think she's going to do something illegal to get money, you're mistaken. Tasha will always do something dirty to get what she wants until she opens up a legit business and separates everybody she knows from the drug game. That's when she can, you know what I'm saying, live life cool. But as of right now, it's definitely not going to happen. It's just not going to happen, man. But um, you guys let me know. What do you think about Tasha? Do you think Notori's message that she put out on IG is actually a, a sign that's saying like, look, I'm stepping away um, for a little bit. Thank you guys for the opportunity, but I have different things to do. I say this, as I told you guys earlier, I say it's a possibility that she may take a little break, but as far as Tasha's storyline, she definitely has to be in this next installment, this next season. You have to talk about it. It can't just go blank, especially with Tasha, you know what I'm saying? She has to, and her story at the end of the day is still connected to Tariq because that's his mother, and he's always going to do what he has to do to protect her. And I can see her coming back trying to figure out how she can help him, but she has some Tommy issues that she needs to address. So maybe if Tasha goes out to Cali or talks to Tommy Egan and explains to him why she did what she did, maybe then he can stop that pressure. But based off what Tommy is saying, he ain't stopping. He want all the smoke. He's going to continue to try to take her out. So if that's the case, Tasha, it ain't looking too good for you. But y'all know in power, they're not going to stress this story, this storyline out. It's not going to go for too long. I mean, Tommy, he can't hate his family for too long. Eventually, they're going to squash everything. I don't know how long it's going to take with Tasha since she tried to throw him up under the bus. And also... Tommy can't even risk being out there like that anyway since he's faked his death. But we know his mom's, Kate Egan, if she finds out and when she hears about this, she's definitely going to throw Tommy under the bus. Or, you know, she's definitely going to say something that, you know, notifies the feds that, look, Tommy Egan is definitely alive and well. But um, you guys let me know. Leave your theories, predictions, everything down below. Tasha's fate. Will she be returning what do you guys think? Leave it all down. But I will continue to give you guys more Power Book 2 Ghost content in the future. But um, let me go out of here, man. It's your boy, Mark Dark. I'm out. Peace.